Hi, my name is Kieran, and today I will be showing you a new and exciting feature implemented into Cabinet Vision version 2021. We will be looking at finger pulls and how they can be assigned to door edges. To get started, we will open up the Material Manager, head over to the Pools category, and click on the Add New button. You will notice in the list of material types, we can now select Finger Pool. We can give the handle a name and a short description. We can then set the correct specifications. There are three types to choose from here. C rail, flat rail and U rail, which accounts for most of the different types of finger pulls on the market. Depending on the type of finger pull we select, we have the option to add mounting holes or slots. And like all other materials in cabinet vision, we can specify the finish colour and texture to make it look realistic. Now that I've created the finger pull, we will go ahead and open the schedule manager and create a new pull schedule. We can give it a descriptive name and then within this schedule I can assign the newly created finger pool as the schedule's finger pool material. Next we need to set up the finger pool door in the door manager. For this I will copy the default door slab and call it finger pool slab. In the properties of this door we can set up which edges should not have banding and which edges should have a finger pull. With everything set up, we can head over to a new job to take a look. Here I will need to select the materials we have created, firstly the pull schedule and then the door. Here you can see the finger pull added to the door. Cabinet Vision also offers the feature of changing which edges have finger pull applied to them from the cabinet section editor, making it easy and flexible. Thank you for taking the time to watch this short video.